Hey everyone, welcome. Thanks so much for joining me. I have another Halloween mini album I like to show you. Um, it's mini because it's small, but then look at the spine. This <laughs> spine <laughs> must be at least four inches or something. I don't even have a ruler here, do I? No. It's got to be at least four inches. Um, I don't know where I <laughs> came up with this spine, but I've seen someone do a spine like this on YouTube, and I thought, okay, let me give it a try, but then look how big it is. It is so big. Look how it stands. It, you know, because I didn't use, um, um, what do you call it, chipboard. That's why it's going like this. But if I want to lay it flat, I can like that and store it, but it's going to be this thick. Imagine filling it up. <laughs> So the first page we have here, which is okay, it kind of lies flat. I have my belly band here. So there's one belly band here and another belly band on the bottom. So it's a belly band on top of a belly band. And I just, you know, stick it in like that. And then here it's magnetized. So it opens up like this and like that. And then it's a pocket. So you can put something here. And then it closes back up like that and to the next page so the next page opens up like a card and it goes like this so it's a card so I put cards into this album and so you have all these little spots where you could put pictures on and it's a cool little thing to have nope nobody will know they'll think it's just a normal page until you open it and then we move on to this one and then this one I just left plain just uh, a pocket and this one here it opens up like this and then this one opens down like so hopefully I'm getting it all in the camera and then these flaps open up like this and of course more orange so then you have all this which I thought is awesome to have all these photo spots and um, they don't uh, have any uh, pockets here, which is a good thing because it's already thick. And here's another belly band I made. It just tucks in there. And this is ribbon I used uh, that I got from uh, the Dollar Tree. And then this one is just blank page. And then here I made this card and this just opens up like this. So it's one of those uh, Z fold cards that opens up. So it's a Z fold card. And of course the same ribbon I got from the Dollar Tree I put there, which I thought is awesome. And this opens up just plain. And look at the gussets in there so you could add lots of stuff. Another plain thing, just add photos. And here's like a gatefold card or something and it opens up like this. And I think you could uh, possibly put a little Polaroid picture in here, you know, those little Polaroid uh, printers you get. You could put a little picture in there. And then one on this side. And then it folds back down like that. And then blank again, so you can just put your pictures on there. And then this one, it opens up like this. And I put some uh, stickers in there. And then this opens up like so. And then this opens up like that. So you got your peekaboo cards here. These are what are called peekaboo cards. This is an actual card like this. So I made the card like this from, um, I think I got this from Dawn Stamping Net, something like that from Dawn. And uh, this is the card, and you open up the card like this, and it's a peekaboo card because it's, you know, peekaboo. And she cut it out like this to make it peekaboo. So that's how I made my card. And then the last page is just blank. So this is a very thick album. Um, you could see um, like that how big it would be when you add all your stuff and all my cards that I put in there. You could also have it on display like so and have these things pop up if you want like that, you know. So there is my Halloween <laughs> mini album. 
Thank you so much for joining me. Until next time.